Hello everyone, Cody the Dragon Samurai here, and welcome to part two of my Bakugan collection. And if you haven't seen my first part, I'll put a link in the description below for you to check it out. Here are all the cards I have in my collection. I'll start off with all the gate cards I have, then move on to ability cards, and the battle gear cards, so yeah. I'll start off with this giant card here, which is what I got with... This one Heias Bakugan here in my Baku clip. It's huge, as you can see, compared to a normal card. Let's say it's three or four times bigger than any normal gay card. Any normal card. So yeah, and here is the front. It's Decaventus. Don't think you can use these giant cards in official tournaments. Yeah. These little symbols here are the attributes, the six attributes you have. So you have Pyrus, Aquas, Subterra, Chaos, Darkus, and Ventus. So depending on what Bakugan is standing on the gate card, that Bakugan will get an extra G power boost based on its attribute in battle. Yeah, normal gate cards come in three colors. Silver, copper, and gold. Silver cards have no abilities on them at all. And here's an example of a silver ability card. Gate card, I mean. Reflection gate. But they will add extra G power to your Bakugan. While bronze cards, some special abilities that can help change the tide of the game. And there's also a gold gate card here which can either be character specific as in if a certain Bakugan is standing on the card and battling against another Bakugan you would apply some special effect effects to that well like the bronze cards the gold cards also have some abilities as well while providing an extra G power boost based on whatever Bakugan is standing on it. And here's a sample of a character specific card, Ravenoid, which says each Ravenoid receives an additional G power boost from this card, which you can hardly see because the camera focus sucks on this one, this iPod, I mean, yeah. Here's an example of a bronze card. Building Blocks, which says 71 Bakugan received an additional G power bonus from this card. I think it's referring to the 71 Bakugan, which are the Bakugan like Maxis Dragonoid and Maxis Helios. Yeah. I won't get into too much history about some of the other stuff they have in there, so. It would just take too much time and stuff out of the video, so, yeah. I also have some duplicates in here, so yeah.
that's all my gate cards. Now for ability cards, which there's three colors of ability cards. Almost not forget about some of my other gate cards have actually. So these three cards here are from the third season, Gun Dealing Invaders, and here they have a completely different layout. As you can see, but they are still the same cards. So here's a silver card. A bronze, which has an ability called Riggedy Bridge, which says that G Bakugan, the lowest G power, wins the battle. Yeah. And Aronoth's Turf, which is this gold Bakugan card. This gold gate card, I mean. This, the Bakugan with the lowest printed G power gets plus 50 for each point of power level. Yeah, and that's all my gate cards now. 